it could be the greatest change to the planet's environment many of us will ever see. Within a few decades, the vast sea ice that spreads over the North Pole could disappear for weeks or even months in the Arctic summer. The last time this happened, scientists tell us, was long before humans set foot on the Earth. The Arctic sea ice is retreating as climate change advances. The change being felt in this fragile world is caused in part by us. And it's happening so fast, it's defying scientific models. What you have to remember is that even three or four years ago, the scientific community was saying, this is an emergency, this is something serious. We could have an ice-free Arctic by the year 2070, by the year 2080. In the last few years, those predictions have come way, way in towards the present. And now we're saying maybe 2030, maybe 2020. There's a group that makes a very strong case that in 2012 or 13, we'll have an ice-free Arctic, as soon as that. Well, we're looking here at a satellite animation of September sea ice extent extending from 1979 through the year 2006. This red line that you see, that's showing where ice ought to extend to on a typical year. The September of 2007, it was the least sea ice we'd ever seen in the satellite record. Everything we look at tells us that what we saw in September 2007 is unprecedented. It may well be the least sea ice we've seen in thousands of years. But just as the shrinking of the great Arctic sea ice is alarming scientists, it's triggering a new Arctic race for oil and gas that will produce more greenhouse gases. And it's reviving the dreams of an Arctic shipping route that defeated navigators over the centuries. If you want to see climate change happening before your eyes, scientists will tell you, go to the ends of the Earth. And that's why we're here in the Arctic Circle. We're about to enter the fabled Northwest Passage. This is where so many early explorers lost their lives trapped in the sea ice when they were searching for a shipping route across the top of the world. Last year, at the end of summer, the Northwest Passage was virtually ice-free for the first time in recorded history. To many, that was an unbelievable event. Tonight, Four Corners goes to the Arctic to investigate whether the great sea ice melt will be a tipping point for rapid climate change.